hello everybody welcome back to my channel this is kitty and today I am doing another video on basically a show-and-tell um, there are I've had quite a few paintings that I have finished and I have told you at the end of probably most of my videos that I will show you what they look like when they are done um, it's been quite some time but um, I've finally been able to uh, get get them all done and, and ready for you guys to see. So this is all that this is about. Um, I have um, more paintings to show you because I do have a lot. And um, it's probably going to be spanned out between a couple videos or so, or so, with paintings and coasters that I've finished. Um, so I'm just showing you my product. Uh, everything is for sale unless I say otherwise um, but I think everything from here on out is for sale um, I will put my email down below and you just let me know if you see anything or or uh, just let me know what you're interested in if you are if not that's okay but um all right so I'm gonna get started because my my last video was pretty long so I'm gonna try not to make this too long all right so um, now some of these are older and some of them are newer some of them you guys might have seen um, but I'm just gonna do them all I do have um, quite a few at work I take paintings to work and leave them there for two weeks just so people can see and I can get my so I can like you know spruce up my my office space but um, all those are resined most of them and uh, I'll be bringing those back in here in about a week or so but um yeah so expect more so all right so this is one you guys I did a while ago it was a uh, I really am trying to get away from blues and purples <laughs> but this was one actually uh, inspired by Alan Welch um, the colors and I just thought it was cool because it kind of looks like a planet over here and like space debris or something but I thought it was cool I think I actually tried I did I did something on it and then I just didn't like it I think I might have scraped it or something I don't remember but if you guys watch my videos you'll see it so there's that one it's pretty cool I think it I think it's pretty cool all right so there's that one and then this one I know you guys have seen this is my pretty uh, cloud pour with of course my purples and I did put a little butterfly right there purple butterfly um, honestly because I thought it was dry and of course you know you gotta touch it so I touched it right there and it really bummed me out so I put a butterfly right there but you can't really tell I don't think <laughs> I don't know but it's really pretty like this is one of my purple cloud pours so there's that one and then <clears throat> these two are serious oldies um, wow these are really older way older um, from back in the day when I first started this was my attempt at a uh, um, a boiler maker back in the day um, I did a few of these and they just couldn't come out like Christina Welch's I tell you she does amazing work I know if you are watching my video I'm pretty sure that you already know who she is so um, yeah shout out to her she's amazing she taught me a whole lot and I do appreciate her but this is what I came out with back in the day this is like old you guys this is old anyway so there's that one and then this one I tried to do on my own purple and teal this one I call my purple people eater come on now no don't do that not now so this one I did I was trying to do uh, how cool is he he's so cool he reminds me of a dragon if anybody knows um, that song uh, one eye one horn flying purple people eater then if you don't know it then I feel old and thank you for that but um 
this is my purple people eater. My one-eyed, one horned flying purple people eater. That's what this is. This is old. Like, this was my first, I think, my first attempt of doing two different colors. I did do these. However, the eye, like, that was not there when I was done. That totally developed. I woke up the next morning and there it was. So that was totally cool. So he's pretty cool. He's resined. Um, the other ones are varnished, but he's resined. He's pretty cool. Anyway, there's that one. From my purple people eater. He's awesome. Alright, so... Next we have... Um, what do we have? We have this one. I think I've shown you. I don't know, but this was my um, attempt at a... Uh, gosh, it was a... I want to say June challenge. Um, from Smart Art Materials. Um, it was a kiss pour with uh, Fire and Ice. This is what I had come out with. Um, I think I did three of them. Uh, maybe four. I've sold, I sold one. Gave away one for a present. Maybe that was only three. But this is what I had done. This, I airbrushed that. So this is my fire, a fire and ice pour from back in the day. So there's that one. And then this one I absolutely love because, well, it's blue. Um, teal, white, and black is what this one is. This kind of reminds me of a river or something. Space. Different, um, definitely different things you can think of out of this one, but uh, yeah, I like this one too, this one's pretty. So there's that one, um, alright, moving along. Okay, so, let's see, this one is an older one also from, sheesh, Back in the day when I first started. Please. But I don't know why like it's doing this to me. I had a problem like that um, a while ago, but where it wouldn't focus. Alright. So this one was from a while, like a long time ago. This one's more blues, like um teal, looks like teal, white, and black. Uh, metallic. Metallic teal looks like. That was a long time ago, but um, that's that one, and this one is newer. I did this one not long ago, trying to get away from uh, my blues and purples again. This was a, <coughs> sorry, this was a um, leftover paint pour, I believe, and I do not remember how I did this. I don't know if there's a video. Uh, but yeah, definitely, definitely different, and I honestly do not remember how I did this. If I did a video, I'll have to go back, but I'm not sure if I did or not. But, um, that's just dented from the paint. So yeah, that one's a very, kind of looks like a tornado thing right there, huh? That's pretty cool. Yeah, I don't remember how I did that. So, um, yeah, I don't remember. So there's that one. And then here is another Fire and Ice I did. I think, um, I don't remember how I did this one either. But this one was very recent also. This one came out really cool. Like it didn't, um, like they didn't, they didn't, like, cross at all, I don't think. There's a little dot of red right there, but... This one is really pretty, and it's so soft. Um, I wish I could remember. You guys, I have done so many paintings. Like, I paint a lot, and I have so much inventory. 
So again, if you guys are, if anybody is interested in anything, just let me know. I will put my email down below and you just let me know which one you like or you're interested in and we will, we will talk. This one's way cool. This one's so pretty. I love this one. I love how they did not, um, like the colors didn't jump over. That's very cool. Okay. Moving on. Moving on, moving on. I have like so many totes full of paintings. Plus walls and oh my goodness. Alright. So, next one is an older one, like way older. Another um, <laughs> boiler maker attempt. Oh my gosh. I tried the uh, red, white, and blue. Yeah, so that's this one. This one's older. Come on now. Alright, so there's this one. Yeah, very different. Like this one. This is another Boilermaker attempt from back in the day. And I honestly have not tried them since back then. I do have a few of them. But, uh. I haven't attempted them again because I just, Christina Welch is just like, she's the queen. She's got it. <sighs> so there's that one. And what we got? All right, this one's a newer one. This one is a golden white cloud pour. It's got all the gold shimmer there. I love this one. What the heck? I have a, um. I have a 10 by 20. I think I did three of these. I did a 10 by 20, and I think two of these, but I don't know. I have so many paintings. All right, so here's this one Cloud Pour, gold and white. Very, it's very pretty. It's very shimmery because of the gold. Everybody, if you paint, you know how the gold shimmers. So there's that one. And we have, shoot, and they're falling. Okay, this one, oh my gosh, I love this one too. This one is amazing. All right, this one was a dirty pour. Teal, white, and black, and silver. This one is so awesome, you guys. I really like this one. Um, it's so different. I mean, just as far as like the the design, but it's so pretty. I really like this one. So there's that one. So you're gonna hear me say that I love this painting a lot because, well, you know. All right, here is one that I did. Um, I tried doing the, of course it's blue. I did the tape. I painted my canvas black because I didn't have a black canvas. So I painted it black and then I put my tape on it. And then I did a pour, my pour. And, um, and then I lifted the tape. And that's how this came out. So this one's very cool. This one's very, very different. I haven't done any more of these. But, I don't know, I might do another one at some point. Um, this, is, this one's very pretty. Alright, so let me put these away so I can get more. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright, so... Sorry, trying to put them back in that tote. Alright, so you guys might have seen this one. I don't remember. But this one was a... This was my first... Um, uh, what do you call that? Tree ring. Breck a tree ring or something. So here is this one. This one's 
awesome. Like, I don't remember the colors. I'd have to go back and look. But I did do a video on this. I remember that. So, I remember, um, I remember doing it because I remember Shelly, or Sherry, not Shelly, Sherry, um, had done it and I was like oh I just I just need to do it so I did it so this is my wreck uh, my wreck a ring pour or something so I love this one because what do you guys see like everybody like I think my daughter pointed it out first but this is a little slug and it looks like it's raining or something you know some sort of weather but this is a slug. I call this my little slug. And maybe he's on a leaf or something. But check it out. He's so cute. This is my guy. My little guy. My little slug guy. So this is my wrecker ring pour. That I did. It's on a level 2. But yeah, he's cute. I wish I could remember the color. It's on a video though, you guys. Just go back. So there's that one. And then these next three... Um, I did, these are Dutch pours. I had done them, I believe, one right after the other. And, um, so, I don't remember which one I did first, but here's one of them. They are dark. They were made with, um, let's see. I gotta fix this here. Okay, sorry, I had to pause that for a minute. Alright, so these next three... Uh, the background is um, Purple Lake, and I did a Dutch pour using, gosh, this is a while. I know it's gold, um, I think dioxazine purple, and maybe violet? I don't know, I, don't, I honestly don't, it's been a while. I, they, I, they do have videos, and I did do three of them. So here is one of them. I hope you guys can see it. So there's some of the gold. They, they really are so pretty. I have these hanging up for a very long time. But I had to switch out, you know? So here's one of them. Very pretty if you like purple. So there's one. Um, here is another one. <laughs> I did three of these. So here's, here's one with more gold. And more of a... More flair. I don't know if you, what you call it, but there's more gold. So pretty. I wish you guys could see these in person because they really, really. I mean, if I'm looking at it like this, like you can really see all of it. There's, you know, I might have magenta in here too. Because this. Yeah, I've got, I think I do have magenta in here, but there's the gold. You guys can see that really good. And, um, yeah, that's really, got a lot of white little, um, flares out here. Okay, see that one? Okay, there's that one. And then one more. Here's another one. You can see the lighter purple there. There we go. See the lighter? I don't know. I don't know. You guys, I'd have to go back to the videos. Unless you guys have seen them, you can tell me what colors they were. <laughs> I know there's gold and magenta. I'm pretty sure. And maybe violet. Dioxazine. I'm trying to get it at a good angle where you get... Oh, there you go. How cool is that? That looks, to me, in my, my camera, this looks blue. And I know, okay. So that looks kind of bluish, but it's not, it's purple. I want to get it at an angle where you guys can really see it. Ugh. Ugh. The glare. The glare and the, ugh. There we go. Yeah, this is a pretty cool one. So, there you go. There you go. Um, that's it for this one, you guys. Um, 
I do have more, so stay tuned. Um, uh, if you have not subscribed, please do so. If you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up and hit that uh, bell so you guys will be notified uh, every time I upload a video. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment. Let me know what you guys think. And that's it for this one, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.